Hello, everybody. Come on in. Welcome in, welcome in, everyone. Hi, I'm Yvette, and this is Yvette Hymn of the Week series. I hope that everyone is doing well today. It's been a little storming in the South, and we're definitely in prayer for all of those tornado victims um, here in Georgia, Alabama, and in Mississippi. And all of all the people that are being affected all over the world. We definitely want to keep them in prayer. And any kind of help that we can give them, we definitely need to do that as well. So I'm just going to do a little playing as I always do. Hello, Miss Adela. Hey, hey, hey. As I always do, just do a little playing here. And then later on, I will be introducing the hymn, or my hymn of the week, which I will admit is a very familiar hymn. So when you all hear it, if you know it, feel free to sing along with me. So right now, just sit back, relax, and just enjoy a little music. Mr. Royce Tillman, Sanctuary, and Sister, Dr. Sister Tillman, for you. Sanctuary, 
You know, when you start getting younger in life, you have to have um, all kind of help papers here, there, everywhere, because, you know, because you're so young, the words um, sometimes try to elude you. <laughs> so I want to welcome everyone in again. Um, this is um, Yvette's Hymn of the Week series, and I have really been enjoying it. And I believe, if I'm not mistaken, this is week 20. Let's see if I can get the right, the right thing here going. I should know about now, so here we go. A little loud, I'm going to have to tone that one down. But yes, so this is week 20. Wow, that's awesome. So it's been 20 weeks since I've been introducing hymns. I haven't missed a Sunday yet, but I will tell y'all in advance, there will be two Sundays that this will be pre-recorded because I will not be here. So um, you all will get the notification that it is up and coming. I may be able to talk via uh, messages, but it's going to have to be pre-recorded. So I'm just going to let everybody know. Hey, 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 what's up, Jen? Oh, the sister. <gasps> McGuire. Okay, this lady right here. Hello, Mrs. McGuire. I still call you that. Oh my gosh, from elementary school. Okay, guys. Oh my gosh. Um, hello, Deacon Harton. Thank you so much for coming in. Oh wow. So yes, yeah, so we're gonna be going somewhere. So it's gonna be pre-recorded. So. Um, just want to let y'all know that, and as it gets closer to um, the month of um, the end of April, I will definitely let everyone know. So I'm just going to continue doing some playing, and then I'm going to introduce my hymn. No, no, Jennifer, I'm not coming to Seattle. <laughs> We're going on a cruise, a well-deserved cruise. My husband has never been on one. I can't wait. It's going to be a lot of fun, so something different, but anywho. Seattle, though, soon. I'm, I'm, we're, we're working on that. We're working, we're working on the West Coast, um, Jennifer. We definitely are. So, again, y'all just sit back and relax and just enjoy a little playing and, and me trying to sing a little bit.
just a closer walk with you. What's up? What's up, niece? It's good to see you. Thank you, LSOG. 20 weeks. And we're coming up on a, on a week with, um, with the community, too. Mm-hmm. Yes, indeed. Once again, hello, Donna. How are you? Once again, welcome in. And I'm just tickled pink with Miss Pat with um, Mrs. McGuire there. Um, welcome in again. This is something that um, I wanted to do starting last year, and I did start it last year. Um, I love hymns. I love gospel music. I love gospel hymns, Christian hymns. I love hymns. Um, praise and worship. Thanks, hymns, words, songs of thanksgiving, gratitude to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. I love it. I love it. So with that said, the hymn of the week that I have chosen today is another one that has been sung in different tempos um, as a child growing up. You know, again, when you don't know all the words, you have to just make up words. <laughs> I don't know if I want to tell y'all some of the words I made up with this particular song, but anywho, thank God for his grace and mercy that he looks over babes. <laughs> so the song of the week is Leaning on the Everlasting Arms. This song, it says the words are by um, Elisha, I'm sorry, Elisha um, Hoffman and Anthony Showalter, I think. That's how you pronounce their names. But this, this hymn is um, very traditional. Um, growing up in the Baptist in the Baptist Church, not saying that a lot of the musicians did not know how to read music because the majority of them did, but we just like to put a little um, oomph, maybe a little um, extra spicy to some of the hymns. So without further ado, if you all know this song, sing along with me as I always do um, at the end of my videos. I have the words there for people that don't know all the words, and I'm looking at three verses, of course, one chorus. Um, so feel free, if you want to look back at the video, you can look back at it and sing along, okay? So since I'm still getting younger, the key of C has become very, very easy on my voice, so that's what key I'm going to do it in in case anyone pops in and wants to play an instrument with it. I'm in the key of C. Leaning on the everlasting arms is the hymn of the week.
leaning on the everlasting arms. Normally that was sometimes during um, fellowship um, or doing um, communion collection, collections um, in the church. So leaning on the everlasting arms, I did three verses and chorus. Hi, Monica. Hello, Miss Dora. Um, yeah, uh, and Monica, by the way, today is my Dora's birthday. My grandmother, who's passed on, today is her birthday. Mm. Um, so I'm just going to continue just to play a little bit more. And y'all can just sit back and just come on in and enjoy the music. I won't hold you much longer, I promise. <laughs> so in honor of my grandmother, I think I am going to do one of her favorites. Let me see if I can get it together here. It's a song by the Angelic Gospel Singers. She loved the Angelic Gospel Singers. And I had the pleasure of um, actually speaking with the lead singer. They called um, her nickname um, was Babe. They called her Babe. And um, that was really a joy because I've been listening to their music for years. Um, so they were outstanding female women's group, and they don't really call them quartets. Or <laughs> but the song goes, <clears throat> You don't know what the Lord told me.
I hadn't played that in years. All right, cuz. Hey, Tamika. Oh, my. Okay. Come, people coming in. Let me. Hello. Hello. I'm just playing, recognizing everybody. Hey, D. Hey, cousin. How goes it? Thanks for popping in. So, order my steps, y'all. Um, singing like I used to high guide me every day sing your anointing father I pray order my steps in your word please order my steps
Touch my heart, oh Lord, speak to me. If you can use anything, Lord, you can use me. I thank y'all so much for coming in. Um, I'll be here every Sunday. I'm going for a year. <laughs> I'm on week 20 now. <laughs> so every Sunday at 4 p.m. Eastern, Hymn of the Week. And it's been exciting so far. I have learned a few new hymns and doing a lot of old hymns that I know and um I will be getting involved with some more newbies that I'm some some that I'm still learning and trying to see how I want to do. But just introducing us to um, to him because it's um, I don't have my hymn book with me. But it's interesting that we have in the hymnal what close to 600 songs, but we only sing maybe 10 or 15. There are beautiful hymns in here beautiful words with beautiful meanings. And so I just really want to um, sing as many of them as I can. And I may go over a year. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see how the Lord guides me. And uh, whatever he says, I plan on doing it. <laughs> so listen, thank you all so much for coming. And do be sure to come back next week. This time, I will be here. And Subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share. And if you have any suggestions for hymns, let me know. I may know them, and if I don't know them, I will learn them, and I will introduce them as a hymn of the week. Again, God bless you all so much. Yeah, this is, uh -huh. I hope, Monica, I hope that you see D there. Um, I will have to say, that, like I said, this is the 20th week, and I have really benefited a lot from doing these hymns and learning some new hymns and learning the background on some of the hymns. And um, it's really been refreshing for me. So 
until next Sunday, which is April the 2nd. Guys, this is the last Sunday of the month. Oh, my goodness. The last Sunday of the month. We're getting ready to go into Easter. Mm. God bless you all. Stay safe. Stay prayed up. And I'll see you out in social media land. Okay? God bless you. Bye-bye. Until next time.